bringing you the news and information you need from the people making a difference. This is Comcast Newsmakers. Hi, I'm Sabrina Register. Welcome to Comcast Newsmakers. We're here at the Shilshoal Bay Beach Club in Ballard, and I am joined today by Diane Douglas, who is Executive Director of City Club. Thank you so much for being here today. It's a pleasure. Thank you. For those who don't know, what is City Club? City Club is a nonprofit organization devoted to inspiring, educating, calling citizens to action. Which is a mouthful. I mean, that's, a, <laughs> that's encompassing quite a bit. So talk about the different areas where City Club focuses. Sure. Um, we have education programs. They're located primarily in downtown Seattle, but increasingly throughout the county. And they inform uh, people about politics, about education, about the environment and sustainability, about transportation, all kinds of issues that are really vital for us to know to advance our community. Are you seeing more people wanting to get involved today? We really are. I actually think that with the economic downturn, we've seen a lot more people volunteering. Um, with the last national election, a lot more interest in politics and voting. A lot more interest in neighbors helping neighbors because we need each other. And so hopefully, much. President Obama is also inspiring people to get out and volunteer I think so, and get absolutely. involved. Talk about a campaign that you guys are about to kick off. Yes, so in that light, we are just about to kick off the second annual Community Matters campaign. I'm wearing a button today that, that talks about the themes of the campaign. We believe that the four key ingredients for civic involvement are knowledge, connection to each other, mm -hmm. trust that our voices matter and how we can improve our lives, working together, and then finally action. And so this campaign is all about nurturing those four basic ingredients of civic involvement. And so how are you going to go about with this campaign? Because it's a little different than perhaps some of the other programs you guys have been doing. Exactly. It, first, it's different because there's a time frame. And it begins on September 11th, which is the King County United Way Day of Caring. And it ends on Election Day. So it's contained within that area. And we, f which is different from our programming all year round, which has many, many focuses, this one is focused on two key topics that were just recently identified in the new, new Seattle Foundation Healthy Community Report. What are the most vital needs that our community needs to, to focus on? And so the report targets education and economic opportunity. And that's what will be the dialogues, the forums and information sessions, all of, and the volunteer opportunities and actions and voting all around educating people about those two key issues and talking about what we can do as a community to improve them. So is this Healthy Community Report already out? And it is. Okay. And people can go to the Seattle Foundation's website and look at it right away or get a copy, a physical copy, right away. Will people be surprised in what they see and read in the report? Well, I think, um, I think they will be surprised. I think they will be surprised um, by the disparities that we see in King County in terms of opportunity. But I think they'll also be delightfully surprised at the opportunities that we have coming, coming down the road, um, green jobs, um, communities pulling together to create really innovative solutions for youth development and crime, um, all the work that's going on around urban agriculture, those kinds of things that are really bright spots on the horizon, and especially the collaborations and synergies between organizations, between government and nonprofit organizations, between educational institutions and community centers. Those are the real bright spots that we need to focus on in advance. And Another way this program or this campaign is unique is people um, are not coming just to downtown Seattle. It's spread right. throughout, or they don't even actually have to leave their home if they exactly don't want to. Exactly right. So the Community Matters campaign is all about getting everybody's voice at the table, and that happens in lots of ways. We do have programming throughout King County. The dialogues that we're focusing on are all free, and they're going to happen in churches and community centers and schools. Um, the educational programs will also be available throughout. Many of them are focused towards our next election, so they have immediate results. We'll have People's Choice Awards where people can vote on strategies to help education and economic opportunity. And all of this material is going to be available at our website for people to find out about, which is seattlecityclub.org. And you can sign up for a dialogue there. You can get involved. Um, you can connect to volunteer opportunities. Diane Douglas, thank you so much. Unfortunately, we're out of time. Diane with City Club, thanks so much. And thanks for watching Comcast Newsmakers.